Hey guys, welcome to the 2018 MCAT preparation questions. This is question 13 in this series. As usual, here's the question. Pause the video and have a go by yourself and uh, see how far you can actually get with this question. Okay, so I'm going to get started with this question. So we've got three positive even numbers and it says that if I square the first two numbers and add them and then subtract the square of the third la and largest number, I get an answer of zero. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to write down my first even number here. My first even number, I'm going to write that as x. Okay. Now remember that even numbers are in two. So for example, the second even number would be whatever the first even number is, plus two. Okay. And then if you take the third even number, then it would be x plus one. Four. So we have a first even number. We are squaring the first even number plus the second even number squared minus the third even number squared, and all of that is actually equal to zero. Okay. So our first even number is x. So that's going to be nice and simple. That's x squared. Our second even number is x plus two squared minus my third even number is x plus 4 squared, and all of this is equal to 0. So next step is to expand the brackets. So we have x plus 2 multiplied by x plus 2 minus x minus 4, multipl sorry, x plus 4 multiplied by x plus 4, and that's equal to 0. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this x plus 4 squared in, a, in a, another bracket because remember, that minus actually affects all of the terms inside the light blue bracket. So expanding this, I get x squared plus x squared plus 2x plus 2x plus 4 minus, I'm going to put a blue bracket again. Here inside the bracket I've got x squared plus 4x plus 4x plus 16 and that's now equal to 0. So simplifying things, I've got x squared plus x squared, that's going to be 2x squared. And then I have plus 4x plus 4. And then inside the blue bracket, I'm going to simplify this to be x squared plus 8x plus 16. And all of this is still equal to 0. Expanding the brackets out, I get 2x squared plus 4x plus 4 minus x squared minus 8x minus 16 and all of this is equal to 0. So simplifying this now, 2x squared minus x squared is x squared, 4x minus 8x is negative 4x and then plus 4 minus 16 is minus 12 and this is equal to 0. So I've got a quadratic that equals to 0 so that means I need to factorize and I'm looking for two numbers that multiply to negative 12 and add up to negative 4. That's going to be negative 6 and plus 2. Which means x minus 6 is equal to 0 or x plus 2 equals to 0. Now when I do x minus 6 equals to 0, I get x is equal to 6. And on this side I'm going to get x equals negative 2. Now, I know that x was the first even number. But remember, the question actually said we're looking for positive even numbers. That means we're not going to deal with x equals to negative 2. That means our first even number is equal to 6. And our second even number is equal to 8. And our third even number equals to 10. And if you think about it, 6 squared plus 8 squared minus 10 squared, well, that's actually equal to... We've got 36 plus 64 minus 100. And then 100 take away 100 is equal to 0. So that's how you know you're on the right track. Cool. That's basically it for this uh, short little video, guys. If you have any questions, pop it in the comments below. As usual, thank you for watching. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.